Hello! In this video I will show you how to use the new feature of Holder Wallet, which is called Holder Secure Backup, HSB. HSB is an innovative feature developed by Holder Team after thorough consultations with the community. It will allow the user to create a backup of their SID alternative to the standard paper backup. How does it work? Selecting the HSB option will create a PDF file containing a QR code of the SID. The PDF file is then packed as an encrypted archive. We use state-of-the-art AES-256 algorithm to encrypt the archive, and it can only be decrypted by using the password you typed while creating a wallet. HSB creates a backup, not only of your SID, but also of your entire configuration. So when you restore a wallet using Holder Secure Backup, you will have all your settings intact, including any personalizations you made. But if you prefer to export nothing but the SID alone, Holder supports that too. All you have to do is, instead of selecting Holder Secure Backup, select Encrypted SID QR as the method of backup, and you will create an encrypted archive containing only the SID. What's the advantage of Holder Secure Backup? For one, it will allow you to restore a wallet without having to type in your SID. The password will be enough, and the QR code of the SID doesn't even need to be displayed on the screen of your device. This can provide a line of defense against malicious software trying to capture the screen of your computer or smartphone. The most popular backup method as of now is the paper backup, writing down your seed as a list of words on a piece of paper. The most significant problem with this method is that anyone who happens to find this piece of paper can easily steal all your money. With HSB, even if someone would take control over the archive file, they still cannot access your wallet as it is protected by strong encryption. We believe that the Holder Secure Backup will allow storing of your seed at least as secure as storing a paper backup in a safe. For example, you can put the encrypted archive on a pen drive or an external hard drive and encrypt the whole storage device. Now, anyone trying to extract your seed would have to crack through two layers of AES-256 encryption. Not to get into technical details, but the universe will probably not exist long enough for anyone to do it. And then again, nothing stops you from adding one more layer of defense and do it with a holder secure backup, what you would do with a paper backup. Just put it in a safe. Now I will show you how easy it is to use this feature. We start from holder main screen. Select the settings button, which is located in the top right corner of the screen. Here, click create backup. As you can see, Hodler supports multiple ways of securing your seed. Select Hodler Secure Backup. Of course, to backup your seed, you will need to type in the password. So do it now. Congratulations! Your seed has been automatically turned into a QR code and saved in an encrypted archive. You can now choose your preferred option of saving or sending it. In this video, we will send the seed through email. As you can see, the attachment has been added automatically. So you just have to type in the address and subject of the message. And now just click send. This is completely safe. Even if somebody would gain access to the file without knowing your password, they can't decrypt the seed and steal your funds. And that's it. All it took was a few clicks to secure a backup of your seed. No need to write it down and retype, and it was never displayed on your device, so no malicious software could have captured it from the screen. I hope this video helped you to learn how to use Holder Secure Backup. If you have any questions regarding this or any other feature of Holder Wallet, let us know.